What's up, you guys? Welcome back to the channel. Yo, ho, so cool. Oh, man, y'all already know who I am. Well, today's lesson is today. Um, uh, helping Jordan get moved to another farm. Uh, we just got done with the first, first two farms yesterday. And so we are getting moved to the next farm over. And then we're going, you know, we're just basically getting getting stuff moved now. So, um, look at both ways. So he's in front of me right now, as you can see. And we are headed to, I think we are going to Jackson, Tennessee. I think, I think this is what that road leads to. But anyway, uh, we're going to go over here and knock this out and, I'm gonna try to get y'all guys some uh, combine action, and if I can. So, uh, uh, meanwhile,
Well, there you have it, y'all. It's time for me to get out of here. So, I'm finna do a little OTR here. So, I wish I can get a little bit more footage, man. Hey, it is what it is. <laughs> Doing a good job, Jordan. <laughs> Shout out to you, brother. <laughs> yeah, maybe one day. One day, y'all. I will get a case of each. One day. One day. If the Lord blessed me one once, then I will get one. But right now, it's not really the year to be buying stuff. You know what I mean? So, today is what we're going today. We are going to do a little OTR, like I said, meaning we're going a little bit longer. So, I'm finna go to Bungie. So, that's located in Dinesbury, Tennessee. And dope y'all in West Tennessee knows about Bungie. We know that there's a line down there. It's always a line down there, so. Whew. Golly, real. Let me get some air going on in here. One second. Well, you guys, I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna stop over here in Alamo to get some decent. Uh, I should've got some this morning, but I figured I was gonna get some on the way out. But hey, that is what it is. So, uh, as you can see right here, it's raining. I'm over here trying to get some diesel. So, uh, I'm not for sure that Jordan and them are still running the combine over there. So, uh, hmm. I'm sitting over here eating this sandwich. I had to stop, make a pit stop right quick and get a sandwich. So, what I got right here is a barbecue bologna. Man, you talking about good. Mmm. 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 Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, yeah. Barbecue bologna, man. Y'all should try it. Y'all should come to Thrifty's. If you're here in West Tennessee, West Tennessee, West Tennessee, if y'all around here in the surrounding areas and you're at Thrifty's, y'all come over here and get a barbecue bologna sandwich. Oh my God. So, I'm trying to get I'm trying to get uh, some actual footage. That way y'all can see the combine in action and the tractor and all. But see, they loading these trucks up mighty fast. And it's going to take me a while to get down there to Bungie and then come back to Jackson and jump in another truck. So that's going to be a pretty good jump. So as right now, you know, you can only do the best you can. And plus it's raining right now, so that's not really a showstopper. So, uh, I can be, just be doing that. <sighs> so this is like what I, what I do, you know. So let me just stop talking. Let's get some footage going, uh, checking out the rain and the weather. So let's just go ahead. Let me get done eating this and then let this right here pump in there so I can keep on going. Well, farmers, are we ever gonna get anything done? You're wet, boy. Well, West Tennessee, we got us a old flood here. <laughs> Trucking. I haul your grain in the rain, sleet, snow, whatever the case may be. I make sure you get there and I make sure I get you back. Be way from now. Better ask somebody about me. <laughs>
those of y'all ever come down here and get unloaded at, at Bungie, these roads are rough. Now, picture these roads on, uh, remember I was talking about Great River Road was rough. And I'm saying, man, this road right here is beyond rough. <laughs> All right, we're pulling in up here at uh, Budgie. That's a bigger, that's a bit of a drive from Jackson all the way to Budgie. But hey, I don't care. I don't mind. This is what I do. Now nah, I ain't gonna be able to keep up with them combines now, Joe. <laughs> yeah, cause I'm way out here. <laughs> Pit one or pit, uh, I don't know. Been a while since I've been down here. Uh, I'm assuming it's this right here. Hey, right, you guys, welcome to the barge. As you can see out here, we call it the river. The Mississippi River at that. So this is one of the locations that I haul to or haul from. Uh, these are one of my jobs and uh, they say that I go to Humboldt and I come here or I go to Kenton and come here or Dyer and come here. So I do a lot of hauling in and out of here. It's been a while since I've been down here. So, uh, but yeah, that's the river right there. If ain't nobody ain't even seen it, there it is. Cause if you look back, back years ago, not years ago, if you look back like last year, or two years ago, that river was like really low. And you can actually just about walk across there. That's how low the river was. So when I pull up, I'm gonna show you. Oh, well, there's the river. I remember just about right off cross through there and all around through there. Man, you can just about walk across that. But see, now the water's up. Everything looks good. So now we're gonna head back to Jackson, Tennessee, which is a pretty good stretch. And as you can see, we were running through a little bit of trouble going through a lot of rain and carrying on. So I'm finna go up here, get into another truck and then come on back down. Man, I really wanna get y'all some content on the combine, man. Man, I'm really loving that machine. One day I'm gonna get one, one day, one day. Never know, but the good Lord bless me with one, I will get it. Now, if the good Lord tell me to get one, I will go and get it. Right now, he hasn't spoken to me yet to go buy one. But, uh, we'll see. Let me get my cards together. I got so many of them. So, like I said... This truck right here has a Tyson card. And then I have, also have a bungee card. Then I got a Hickman Kentucky card. And also got a Kwell Illinois card. So this truck been so much of everywhere. <laughs> So why is it so important to have these cards? Technically, really, I just don't know the answer to that. Really, just be honest with you. No, no kidding. I really just don't know the answer to that, why you have to have these cards. I guess uh, you scan in, I guess it prevent people from theft. Uh, okay, I might can say that. Uh, it's kind of like you have to clock in and let people know that you're here and know that you've been here. Well, I'm going to say that as well. So, I don't know. That's, I never did understood a uh, card. See, back then when I was hauling, before I was hauling, when I was hauling for somebody else, 
uh, they didn't have to have cards. Didn't nobody have cards. But now they got cards. So I don't know. I'm just going to say that, you know, prevent theft or whatever, or information, your truck been here or, or whatever, or if the farmer want to check. Hey, DM, DM, we been to this granary and such and such and such, and they can see that I verified that I scanned my card. And yeah, he's been here at this time and yada yada. I think that's what they use that for, just to keep track of everything. So I, I don't know. But, well, let's just stop talking. We headed on out and go back to Jackson's.